The space shuttle Atlantis about to land in Florida, and these are live pictures of the Atlantis making the approach. We're going to bring Atlanta in now CNN's Tony Clark, who has been following the entire mission, right. Tony, in a, in a week that has been filled with all kinds of disappointments. It looked for a while that uh, this morning might have brought another one, but that's been taken care of. It is simply, Atlantis is simply running a little bit uh, 90 minutes later than normal. What we were seeing there was Atlantis getting uh, lined up on runway 33, making its final maneuvers. It is coming in. It is now a subsonic uh, speed right now. The seven astronauts on board in their bright orange flight and entry suits, you can see the, the shuttle with its nose down for its glide in, its rather quick glide in. The uh, NASA officials wanted to land Atlantis at the uh, Kennedy Space Center. It saves NASA about a million dollars as Atlantis opposed to uh, landing at the uh, Edwards Air Force All Base. Right, this is Atlantis's 12th flight and will be its last flight for some time. It goes in for uh, upgrading to bring its equipment up to the standards of the other shuttles. It, uh, it will be out for several months. Commander Lawrence Shriver at the controls here going in. Tony, they had uh, plenty of time, did they not, to make a decision on where to land if, if need be? They had a lot of options. Uh, there, they had four options, uh, landing options today, two at Kennedy, two at Edwards Air Force Base. Early this morning, they waved off that first landing uh, at Kennedy because of rain showers within 30 miles of the Kennedy Space Center. The, uh, the NASA flight rules are such that uh, you cannot land the shuttle when it's raining within 30 miles of the Cape. That uh, weather improved uh, in time for a, uh, a firing of the maneuvering jets, and uh, so they decided to go in to their first choice. We're just about a minute away from the landing. Let's listen in to NASA commentator Carrie Flugel as she talks the shuttle in. Continues to perform very well. Now less than a minute away from landing at the Kennedy Space Center. Landing gears down and locked. Main gear touchdown. This brings to an end the 49th shuttle flight. Watching this, uh, it is, uh, I have seen many of them, and it's still impressive to watch the giant orbiter come in. Uh, beautiful landing today at the Kennedy Space Center. This, as I say, is the 12th flight of the shuttle Atlantis. It will uh, go into uh, repairs, uh, upgrading for the next several months. In fact, its next mission, uh, if my memory serves me correctly, is to go back and get that European satellite that was uh, put in space earlier uh, this week on Sunday, uh, boosted to the, uh, the higher orbit. It will go